good for those guys on uh, on the exit in our end, uh, around the net for them, uh, puck retrieval, and uh, hopefully we can get something going tonight. You've remained productive as in your brief times in Northern, even though you have already moved around with, with different line mates and, and had some power play time. Where is that coming from, that you've kind of been able to score no matter where you've been in the lineup or who you've been with? Well, I think A, playing with confidence. Uh, I've, I've obviously been able to, to feel the puck uh, really well on my stick uh, and B, opportunity. Uh, whether it's uh, having a bad period or a couple bad shifts, uh, the coaching staff has had a trust in me uh, in throwing me back out there, whether it's, it's on the power play or um, offensive line face-off. So I think for me as a player, um, you know, you feel like you have the trust from your coach. Um, you can go out and play, and you don't have to worry uh, too much about you know X's and O's. So um, I think those two things have been real key for me so far this year. When you're you know weighing options in the summer and looking at different teams, you might be able to go try out for. Do, do you envision this that looking at the depth chart in Edmonton, if if you come here and you play well, that you never know what can happen and. I mean, I know you're wanting a spot on a roster, but there was yeah. potential here for this to maybe happen. Yeah, for sure. I, I think, uh, like you said, I think uh, uh, looking at my different options, uh, uh, I thought here would be, A, a good op opportunity for me to earn a contract, and B, uh, looking for a chance to, to play with some good players. And uh, I've been able to do those two things so far this year. So, um, yeah, I'm been special for me obviously uh, uh, with nothing going on and have to earn a contract and not playing the first five games and being able to, to play well from the get-go and getting an opportunity to play, to play with some good players so um, I'm happy with that. Can you, um, and this isn't any disrespect to your skating, but you're playing with the fastest player in the world, yeah. some would say. Leon's a pretty quick player too. How do you, um, you know, how do you sort of approach that, wanting to be able to be there off the rush, but also understanding the speed of the guys you're playing with? Right. Uh, I think A, uh, I think just on the power play, I've, I've tried to, uh, I've tried to watch where Connor is skating towards. So if, if there's a loose puck that's coming up to me, I know I can just put it in their area and he'll be the first guy to do it. Um, so I think I got to bring some of that mentality to my five on five game. Um, I just think my, my uh, hockey sense is, is, is going to help me just to making sure I, I'm, I'm not trailing behind and uh, obviously I'm not going to keep up with him. No one does. Uh, but if I can find myself, uh, you know, being good on the exits in our, in our end and um, you no, know, I know Connor is gonna. He's gonna drive wide in this create create space. If I can come in, um, you know, at the same time, open the lane for him, or uh, coming in at the end, and uh, those two kind of play catch, and uh, I can get you know a little bit of space by myself around the net. Uh, that'd be ideal. Alex, how is the team adjusting to the new coach's priorities? It's been good. Uh, I, I thought um, I was actually really surprised by um, our first game in San Jose, um, not having any practice, nothing, just a couple of videos, how we've been able to kind of change our mindset a little bit. Uh, I know the, the, the point of the score at the end of the game on this road trip, the last two games maybe didn't go where we wanted to be, but just our play in general, we're, we're definitely more connected. Um, I know Hitch is, is being hard on us on um, our compete level and uh, the way we battle uh, around our net and in the corners and how um, a little play may not seem like a lot, but it may lead to something else. So I think uh, everyone's buying into that and we're, we're trying to see, uh, we're seeing a little bit how uh, it's helping us. So uh, it's been really good so far. Alex, uh, you guys look to get back in the at 500, rather, going against uh, the Dallas Stars tonight. A team that scored 31 second period goals. What's the scouting report on the Stars and, and the game plan to kind of get the W tonight? Yeah, um, obviously their first line, uh, one of the best in the league. Uh, um, you know, those three guys create a lot and they play a lot of minutes. So 
uh, I think that's a key matchup for us. And um, I think the other thing that's important is uh, our, our play in um, the offensive zone is, is, is going to help us to not have to defend as much. If we can create second and third opportunities, be, uh, be hard on pucks and execute our plays, we'll be fine.